And a bizarre tweet. Police just could not ignore somebody looking for drugs in Sarasota. The police department's response is getting national attention. The Twitter user asked, who has weed? Well, the Sarasota Police Department's clever answer has gone viral, and John Rogers is joining us live in Sarasota to tell us more about it. John, police must be surprised about all the attention they're getting from this. <laughs> yeah, you can say that again. They certainly were shocked by all this. People all over the world are talking about this story, but the police department here hopes that they can get a message across with this. Uh, Genevieve Judge is always updating the social media accounts for the Sarasota Police Department. And earlier this week, something caught her eye. And we thought, you know, that deserves a response. A young woman at Twitter handle PrezNixon16 asked, who's in Sarasota, Florida and has weed? So Judge wrote back saying, if you'd like to stop by our headquarters, our narcotics detectives would be more than happy to talk. Looking for weed in Sarasota is not the place to be looking for weed. Recreational marijuana is illegal in Florida. And within 48 hours, the exchange went viral. It's been covered in Mashable, Huffington Post, and in news outlets in the UK, Portugal, and even India. We didn't expect the response. Uh, we definitely didn't expect it to go viral. Neither did the Twitter user. She said she never did get any weed. And while corresponding with me, she said, I think it's crazy how something so irrelevant and unharming became so big. She also posted, my tweet does have a good message. There needs to be more weed in Florida. That shouldn't even be illegal. Officials say recreational marijuana is harmful. We need to consider marijuana uh, a much more insidious drug than it really is. We're getting reports from Colorado where recreational use is legal, that the number of ER visits is skyrocketing. Police hope this funny exchange serves as a reminder that they're committed to keeping the community safe. The Twitter user also wanted to add that she is not a crook, and she did not mean for this to become so big. So, here in Florida, uh, possessing 20 grams or less of marijuana is a first-degree misdemeanor, which could lead to jail time, probation, and you could also get your driver's license revoked. Back to you guys. All right, John Rogers live in Sarasota. Thank you, John.